sardonic hose. <laughs> Come on, man, I'm your own personal bully. You love when I come down here and mess with you during your job, don't you? Yeah, yeah, I know. You're like the cornucopia of bullies, okay? You know what? Just because, just because I'm, you know, the new recruit here, doesn't mean you have to give me such a hard time, okay? Just, just think how ethereal your job is because of all of my bully. Okay, first of all, one thing about this uh, firehouse that is kind of freaky, um, this, this fire engine, it's not really up to, up to standard, you know, it's just, it's just a Ford Explorer with a garden hose. <laughs> Bob, there's something you gotta realize. This isn't your classical fire station here. This is a front for our cocaine business. <laughs> So then what's the deal with the jack-o'-lantern that we had to put out of, of you know, the jack-o'-lantern fire? What? <laughs> <laughs> you know, when it was Halloween, some kids came down here and got some cocaine. They got a little discombobulated. They didn't know what they were doing. You can't put kerosene all over the jack-o'-lantern to set it on fire. No, you can't. Oh, no, you can't. Look, I can't get this hose, okay? I don't know what's going on with it. I, I guess I wasn't very good at fire school because I'm in this weird Wyoming firehouse. <laughs> I, I don't know. I'm just I'm just trying to find out what my function is and my conjunction. <laughs> but you know, there's nothing like the cocaine in a firehouse in Wyoming just to bring out that visceral part of you. <laughs>